welcome to the 138th edition of Shunil TV Bulletin where we bring you the latest news from the campus every Friday. I am Saket and here are the headlines for this week. New year ushered in the campus with midnight celebrations. Students shared their new year resolutions. Mathematics day celebrated in campus. Webinar on steels technology organized. And now the news in details but first a special video presentation on the year that just went by. Wasn't it a thrilling year for Shulinians? The new year is expected to be even better. On the occasion of the new year, we also interviewed the Chancellor and sought his comments. Here are the excerpts from the interview. Dear students, teachers and other members of the Shulini family, the year 2002 is coming to an end and the new year will start on 1st of January. Calling Father 2023. I wish you all the best, happy, and everlasting love for your friends, family members, and everyone. I pray that when this year, which is going to replace 2022, become the most cherishable most lovable and should be able to fulfill the wishes of each and every one. Happiness and love should flow universe. Wish you all the best. God bless you. We expect to hear more good news in the new year. Journalism student Manan Monga interviewed some students about their new year resolutions. Here is what they had to say. Hello everyone. So my this year 2023 resolution is be more confident about myself and remember that the only thing you need to wear well is your confidence. World has changed a lot and learning new skills become the necessity of today's time. So my new year resolution is working on my communication skills and learning, time, money and human resource management. Hi everyone, my name is Namisha and my this year goal is I have to be disciplined, I have to maintain my time management, I have to be punctual and I want to improve my skateboarding skills. That's it for me. Hey guys, as we all know, no man is an island. My new year resolutions are to work on my interpersonal skills and time management. Hello everyone, I am Anushka and since it's the beginning of the new year, like others, I'm also taking a new year resolution this time. And this time I need to work on my personal skills and take part in extra co-curricular activities and like dance and all that. And I hope this year will be the better one. Thank you. Good evening. My name is Ayati Mishra. In these changing times of the first space world, my new year resolution is to keep myself updated with the latest technology and the resources of knowledge for the betterment of myself and those around me. The Faculty of Engineering and Technology at Shunin University hosted an online webinar on Indian Mathematics. Here is a report. The Faculty of Engineering and Technology at Shunin University hosted an online webinar on Indian Mathematics and their contribution on the occasion of National Mathematics Day. The main speaker for the session was Dr. Pawan Kumar, Associate Professor at NIT Hamirpur. The birthday of Srinivasa Ramanujan is also celebrated as the National 
Mathematics Day every year on 22nd December. Pawan delivered a session on Srinivasa Ramanujan's achievements. He talked about the history of mathematics and how it has been advanced today. Along with the Indian mathematicians such as Shakuntala Devi and Aryabhatta who advanced the field of mathematics with their exceptional intellect and imagination. Dr. Pawan also discussed the significance of Vedic mathematics and provided some tips for solving problems with larger numbers. Ramanujan Gallery which was developed by Yogananda School of AI, Computers and Data Sciences was also inaugurated on the session. Thanks Aditi. We now have Janvi telling us about a discussion organized by the Belletristic Society. A book discussion was organized by the Belletristic Shuni Literature Society at Shuni University. The main speaker for this session was Ms. Suman Sharma, Managing Director of AK International School, Sargaghat. Ms. Suman said her favorite author was Khalid Husaini and his work The Kite Runner and A Thousand Splendid Sons. Professor Manju Jatka started the event and Dr. Navreet Sai introduced author to the audience. Ms. Suman discussed about the author, his background, his theme and how through these two books has he managed to touch the every essence of Afghanistan. Moving on, we have a special report on the stealth technology. Shreya has more details. The Faculty of Engineering and Technology at Shrini University organized a webinar on 3rd January on stealth technology on the occasion of the 75th birthday of the world's most important device, the transistor. The session was directed by Dr. Charanjit Singh, a professor at LPO. Dr. Charanjit talked about stealth technology and how it is useful nowadays. He also shared a video regarding a bomb which is called F-17 and what are its features and how it is used. Thanks Shreya. Before we conclude, here is RJ Khushi to tell us about Radio Shulni shows this week. Hi guys, Happy New Year. I am Khushi and here are the show lists that you can enjoy on Radio Shulini. Naya Saal, Naya Tehar by RJ Minakshi, New Beginning by RJ Sapna, Audio Brahmin by RJ Tanya and Kase Kahani by RJ Indu. So my dear friends, do not forget to tune in Radio Shulini, Awaaz Vadiyo Ki. With this, I Khushi Rawat wish you a very Happy New Year. Take care and stay safe. That's all for now. We shall meet you next Friday at 11 a.m. with the latest updates from the campus. Do share, like and subscribe to our channel and send us suggestions for further improvements.